The drought is one of the problems creating stress for Minnesota farmers and for dairy producers that's compounded by low prices for wholesale milk. As John Croman reports, Governor Walls journeyed to Lesur today to call attention to the issue. How are you doing? Good to see you. Thanks for having us. I've been on it my whole life. Carl Heldberg's family has been farming this part of Lesur County for generations, but it's the first time they've had a visit from a governor. Any volume moved any way right. yeah, helps so that, everybody. Uh, Carl led Governor Walls and Ag Commissioner yeah, Tom Peterson on a tour of his dairy operation. I bought the neighbors the 30 cows or 35 cows over a three-year contract. At 70 cows, it's a relatively small milking herd by today's standards. This is recycled waste um, wood there that they lay on. But the biggest challenge facing dairy farms right now is depressed milk prices. Commodity prices to our producers are at a, a, a pretty tragic low right now. We saw uh, 23, $24 a hundred weight for milk. Now that's about 14 or so, 14 and a half. It's the cheapest liquid in the most grocery stores and gas stations, so. Cheaper than water. Yeah. Um, Carl sells his milk to bond guards at a time when farmers across the state are struggling to find buyers. Luckily, I'm in a good place right now, but um, I'm one of the fortunate ones. So, um, yeah, it's hard to switch creameries um, or look for better prices. Much of what happens in farm country is determined by federal policy, but the state ag department does have grants and loans and is buying milk for food banks and looking to expand markets. Our markets, whether it's Asia, uh, looking at European, South American countries, something that the Department of Ag does too is to really try to work on those markets. In the end, it's about trying to find ways to keep small dairy operations running because of the role they play in the food supply and in the local communities. In Lesur County, John Croman, Care 11 News.